the Iranian defense industry has developed a new BM-120 surface-to-surface ballistic missile, according to information published on the Iranian Defense Industry Export Military Catalog. The BM-120 released a video on the internet in December 2021 by the Iranian Ministry of Defense and the Logistics Department of the Armed Forces, demonstrating the precision strike capability of the system. It is particularly worth mentioning that the missile hits two different precise strikes almost simultaneously. Target, showing that it has a certain single gun multi target distributed precision strike capability. The BM 120 ballistic missile uses a 6x6 civilian truck chassis with two rows of six square launch boxes at the rear, which can be launched at a 45 degrees angle at the rear of the truck. The advantage of using a modular launch box is that it can be maintenance free after leaving the factory. It only needs to be tested regularly. It is easy to hoist and can be replaced at any time. Two sets of hoisting launch boxes can be directly launched again, which greatly reduces the response time and enhances the operational flexibility. Moreover, the truck chassis also has a compartment cover, which can conceal itself during maneuvering and improve survivability. A large number of missiles in Iran are based on civilian truck chassis. This is also a consideration. All launch operations can be carried out in the cab of the truck. The degree of automation is good, but the vehicle must be assisted by other systems during combat. According to the technical characteristics published in the Iranian arms export catalog, the BM-120 missile has a diameter of 0.368 meters, a length of 5.175 meters, a total weight of 787 kilograms, a maximum flight speed of Mach 4, a range of 30 to 120 kilometers, and is equipped with a 150 kilogram missile. High Explosive Fragmentation Fragmentation, HEFRAG, Penetrating or Cluster Warheads. There is no clear picture of this type of missile, but we can also get a glimpse of it in the screenshots of the launch process it shows. The bomb is designed with a pointed conical warhead plus a cylindrical body. Although its aerodynamic rudder surface is not very clear, it can still roughly see the layout of the front triangular canard rudder plus rear triangular tail plus polygonal swept tail. This layout in the same vein as the Conqueror 110 series, it can be considered as its reduced version. The layout design of the Conqueror 110, FATA 110, series of solid fuel ballistic missiles basically unifies the Iranian short range ballistic missile series. It should be known that, although liquid-fueled ballistic missiles have a longer range and easier technology, their response time is slow, storage is difficult, and reliability is difficult to guarantee. In contrast, solid-fueled missiles have inherent advantages. Iran solid rockets started by imitating the Frog 7 rockets, developed the Seismic series rockets, and learned the ballistic missile guidance and control technology from the imported Chinese M7 ballistic missiles, SAM-2 modification, B-610, missiles. The Sark series of missiles finally developed the Conqueror 110 ballistic missile in 2001. The bomb has a total length of 8.9 meters, a diameter of 0.61 meters, a weight of 3.5 segments, a warhead of 500 kilograms, and a range of about 200 kilometers. The range, from 250 kilometers to 300 kilometers, and finally to 500 kilometers of the Conqueror 313, has a variety of strike platforms. The guidance method is also developed from inertial navigation to satellite guidance, infrared terminal guidance, radar terminal guidance and other types. The strike accuracy has been reduced from 250 meters to about 5 meters. Showing very good striking accuracy. Almost all of the series adopt the layout of front triangular canard rudder plus rear triangular tail plus polygon swept tail. In all fairness, the BM-120 is reluctant to say that it is a ballistic missile. This is called a 370mm long-range rocket launcher in our country.
The BM-120 missile is about half smaller than the Conqueror 110 series, thanks to the proliferation of high-precision and cheap inertial components, satellite navigation and positioning systems, microelectronic control systems and other key dual-use commercialized components. Coupled with Iran due to the technological progress of human beings, it is possible to integrate high-precision equipment in the control cabin of the projectile with a much smaller diameter, thereby enhancing its strike capability. The Iranians claimed that the bomb was guided by an inertial navigation INS, plus satellite navigation system, and the circular probability error CEP, was less than 30 meters. In the video of the attack, there were air explosive fuses used to destroy the target, and there were also direct burrowing strikes, and the strike accuracy was very high. Yes, hitting a concrete building can make a 1.1 meters x 0.9 meters hole, 